Hey, greetings, and welcome back to the channel. You know, thanks for all who are coming back again. I know we've been getting subscribers, and we haven't posted in a while, but definitely, we definitely want to revive that practice going on here. So let us get started. So what we found is an extension, Microsoft extension, right? This is not created by Microsoft, but it basically allows you to take doc and XLS files. It's really any type of file in, uh, that's used in Microsoft Office, right? And it can work fit in VS Code, right? There's also Office Online, right? But then you may not have a bad, you may have a good, not have a good internet connection, tongue twister. Also, there is Microsoft Office, right? But then that's a, that's a subscription you have to pay for, right? So let's take a look at how this works. So I'm going to go ahead and make a file. I'll have it as sample.xlsx. And right, it works as, so this is the VS Code Editor in action. Sample. All right, so now what I'm gonna go ahead and do is sign into my account first. All right, so here's my file. Right, and then here's my data. No issues, no problems. So now let's try it again with Word. I believe it's DLCX is the extension. If not, I can save it. PDF markdown, Windows. Oh, that's interesting. It doesn't have it, right? Well, at least, right? If you're working with Markdown, right? Um, it definitely works out, but let, let's see. If there's an extension right, that we could try to leverage here. says view word Microsoft Word right let's try to take a closer look here try to reload the window see if that will Try to reload the window one more time. All right, it's not indicating that. All right, so docs. can't find it right now, but I think what I'd like to show is how I can open this, how I can work with my markdown files in with um, this extension that I have here. It's like a site talk type thing that can treat it like a Word document. 
And what's good about markdown files is that they can end up as a PDF, right? So I think this is where I'll end the video. Thanks for watching. You know, thanks for if anyone is able to find the extension that can help me edit a Microsoft Word files, right? Unfortunately, this is not the extension. Definitely let us know in the comment section. So thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. And most importantly, reach out to us in the comment section for any help, tips, or suggestions.